Heavyweight Showdown. So here he is, one of the more prolific takedown artists in the UFC at present. And when you get some praise from Daniel Cormier, when it comes to your offensive takedown game, you know you're doing something right. And we talk about wrestlers and judo players and grapplers, but this guy just combines all of that. He is able to use foot sweeps from the grappling game. He is able to use throws from judo, and he's able to use wrestling in the, from the wrestling game to take people down. He has an array of takedowns at his disposal, and he uses every single one of them from the speed of the level change to the timing to the knowledge of where to go next when the guy starts to defend he's truly truly something special i don't think he could take you down but tonight he doesn't have to so he does not in have this to. matchup prevailing wisdom is he'll be able to get this fight to the canvas well this is exciting here dc the founder of jeet kune do one of the founding fathers really of mixed martial arts bruce lee is back in a big spot here tonight bruce lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. And now our tail of the tape for this heavyweight fight. So a more than five-year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age, with some differences in height, but the same reach. All right, now for the introductions, we go to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas, Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a boxer making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet ten inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Fighting out of Kuwait City, Kuwait, Ben. And now introducing his opponent. Fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. You will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. They touch him up, and we are underway. So here we go with the start of round one. I can tell how excited you are for this matchup. Seems to be a slight advantage on one side, but maybe it's a big time fight. It feels like a big moment for both of these guys' careers. Who is going to be able to implement their game plan the best in this matchup between these two big time athletes? Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one up? He engages in a single collar tie here. Lee gets the tie clinch here. Oh, good opportunity to do damage here. He's got that tie clinch. And they separate. Big ball from punch land. Now he gets back to range. Oh, nice knee to the body, 
forehead there. Very nice. All right, both fighters now continuing to try to get a more dominant position. Going orthodox now. Ooh, he landed a huge hook there. Great punch landed with so much power. Nice stick with the right hand. Big left hook coming, it's blocked. Nice body shot. Well placed kick there by Lee. Liver kick, take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. Oh, big right hand, yes. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. He's got a big, that body shot right up through his opponent's third. Block that kick to the body. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. He has commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. I'm not sure his opponent knows where he is. No, he is on Beach Street right now. He's seeing the Tweety Bird over the top of his head. When you take a hook like that, you are on wobbly legs. What a fight so far! Let's check out some of the action now from that previous round, and he really kept finding a home for those kicks. Yeah, and why would you change it? If your opponent is not going to check, if he's going to stand there, and he's not on his toes, and he's stationary, you keep driving those kicks into his thighs, into his body, until he makes some sort of adjustment. All right, next round is underway, DC. We talked Good about fight. his powerful kicks, Great. how he attacks all Good. sides of the body, the head, the legs. Pretty good start for him tonight. That was so impressive to see someone fight almost predominantly with their legs and have that level of success. Yeah. And a miss with the right hook. Nice. Lee gets crushed with that hook. Tried to set up the straight left, but he missed. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, he's still safe, but he's also going to be able to land. He's got to be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. Pretty good knee to the body by Lee. Big kick lands. Watch knees to the body. Oh, big roundhouse attempt, but unable to land. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Oh, huge kick to the body. into these big leg kicks. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. Muay Thai plump. Big punch land. Hard 
shots landing on both sides here. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Oh, how clean is that jab by Lee? What a round. Take a look back at some of the action in that previous round, DC. A lot to like on both sides, Will. I mean, both were intent on going forward. And what happens when nobody wants to take a step back? They meet in the middle. That's exactly what they did, and they both found success over the course of that round. All right, DC, here we go with our next round. It wasn't just the accuracy, it was the aggressiveness, the value. It was unbelievable to watch him be so active, the cardio, the push the pace and the pressure that he fought with, it's gonna be very interesting to see if he can maintain this over 15 minutes. Huge strike lands there somehow. Now he's on top of him looking for the finish. All right, so you gotta be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't wanna mess around for too long. Close guard, strong bottom work here, staying busy. Back to the feet now. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the pool. He needs to start looking the finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. He got a save! Trying to pass the guard here, but a nice job by the bottom fighter defense. Bottom fighter did a fantastic job of following with his hips, making sure he blocked any attempt to get past his guard. Oh! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Well, both fighters pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but you got to be very careful hanging out here for too long if you're his opponent. Well, hard to win fights in mixed martial arts from the bottom, but nice work here in that position by Lee. Trying to guard pass here, not today. No, it ain't happening. Good job understanding the transition. Oh! Big diving punch lands. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh, nice job working hard, posting, and getting back up. Now, now. Oh, boy. Well, he's going to enjoy watching this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment ago. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the one that hit the exact sweet spot that ended his opponent's night. 